And they say Amazon lets other companies sell products on its website, tracks how they do, and then uses that data to compete against them and win. But Amazon flat out denies this. The U.S. government and 17 states are suing Amazon in a landmark monopoly case reflecting years of allegations that the e-commerce giant abused its economic dominance and harmed fair competition. The 172-page complaint alleges Amazon unfairly promotes its own platform and services at the expense of third-party sellers who rely on the company's e-commerce marketplace for distribution. According to the FTC, Amazon has harmed competition by requiring sellers on its platform to purchase Amazon's in-house logistics services in order to secure the best seller benefits referred to as prime eligibility. It also claims the company anti-competitively forces sellers to list their products on Amazon at the lowest prices anywhere on the web, instead of allowing sellers to offer their products at competing marketplaces for a lower price. The FTC alleges that because of Amazon's dominance in e-commerce, sellers have little option but to accept Amazon's terms resulting in higher prices and a worse consumer experience. Amazon also ranks its own products in marketplace search results higher than those sold by third parties. The complaint seeks a court order blocking Amazon from engaging in the allegedly anti-competitive behavior. The FTC isn't ruling out a possible breakup of Amazon, nor the potential for individual executives to be named in a landmark antitrust case against the e-commerce giant. So this is sort of a, a kind of a long-awaited um, case from uh, the FTC and uh, run by Lena Khan. Um, and based on past statements of, uh, of Chair Khan, we could see a breakup of at least part of the company uh, focused on Amazon's retail business. Yeah, and I want to be clear. There, there, there's been, to your point, sort of this speculation, some other reports weeks ago that the FTC was readying a possible lawsuit against Amazon. Lena Khan, who's the head of the FTC, wrote a now very famous legal paper, effectively calling for that when she was at Yale Law School. So Amazon's been on her radar since the time she was a, a, basically a legal student. For months, the FTC has scrutinized Amazon, suing the company in June for allegedly tricking millions of consumers into signing up for Amazon Prime and reaching multi-million dollar settlements in May with the company over alleged privacy violations linked to Amazon's smart home devices. But the latest lawsuit against Amazon may rank as the most significant of all because it drives at the heart of Amazon's e-commerce business and focuses on some of the most persistent criticisms of the company. For years, Amazon's critics have accused the company of everything from mistreating its workers to forcing its third-party sellers to accept anti-competitive terms. 